Welcome back, my fellow Shunmu fans. Saturday time, Suka Pass time. And thanks to everybody again who's voting. Remember, go to the YouTube channel. I'll post it before Saturday. Oh, and then you get to enjoy it. Now, I had to wait for the app to load for a little bit because it has a new update. I'm not going to cover it now because I kind of want to give it its own special and I want to do what everybody voted on. So let's click on it. Now, like I said, new update. It has something to do with the music. It sounds really cool. But I'll cover that at a later date. This time, the vote was in, and the majority of you said, do a character, do a female character this time. So let's click on the Shenmu world. Profiles. And let's see. Let's scroll up here. A female character. It is a boy-heavy game. Let's see. Let's a couple of them. Let's see. You know what? Let's cover one of the bad girls that we meet. Oh, look, they put her right next to Nozomi. Uh, let me see. Uh, flip a coin, flip a coin. Let's do 209 Yumiko Minamino. Screw off, asshole! Right off with a beautiful line. <laughs> Thirsty. Alright, let, let's see here. Yumiko is the leader of a tough girl gang. She always skips classes and loiters around the streets with Rene Isayama, trying to find prey. <laughs> Ryo's the prey. Isn't that, isn't that so fun? That was such a cool thing. First time you play the game, when you go into Dubuita, they're standing just, you know, hooding it up as hoodlums right next to the, uh, the light pole. And just as soon as you get close and talk to them, they got a mouth like a sailor. Appropriate, they're wearing a sailor outfit. Let's see. Okay, sorry. Ba back to the description. Uh, trying to find prey. They threaten girls from other schools and rob them of their money. The police have caught her many times, and that's why the guidance section of the local police knows her activities pretty well. Being wicked and cold-hearted, she doesn't mind fighting using a rod or steel pipe, let alone using foul language. Well, we heard the foul language... And yeah, if you know, you know, when we get to the harbor, when we're trying to save Mai, she's the one who comes at us with a lead pipe. It's vicious. What do we got? Sex female, blood type O, age 17, Zodiac Virgo, birthday, September 17th, height 5'3", weight 106 pounds. Okay, as usual, you can zoom in on the character. Let's just give her a tap and see what other foulness she has. What you want, twit? I'll slap you silly, you pansy. <laughs> Kiss off. Kiss off. What you want, twit? <laughs> the twit one's so good. Screw off, asshole. Dang. Kiss off. The mouth. What you want, twit? <laughs> Kiss off. <laughs> oh. Screw off, asshole. Okay, okay. All right, that's, that's enough for now. Oh, what a mouth. What a great, interesting character. I know, you know, this is something that's epitomized in a lot of literature about Japan where, you know, there's always the schools that have the gang groups that are bullies. Sometimes they have a heart of gold. Other times they're just mean for the sake of mean. I love how far they took it with these characters just being absolute jerks to everybody, especially Ryo. I love his polite reaction of always just, okay, and just like, you know, take a few steps back. This was fun. Thanks again to everybody who took part in the poll. Remember, keep an eye out during the week. It'll pop up on uh, your YouTube feed if you're subscribed. Like, subscribe, ring the bell, all that fun stuff. Next week, I've had a special request, and I am going to take care of it. So to the person who did it, I hope you'll enjoy it. Thanks for stopping by, everybody. Take care.